Throw your diamonds in the sky if you feel the vibe. The rock is still alive. Marilyn Monroe had it wrong. Diamonds are a Yankees best friend. No welcome home party for a 27-time champion would be complete without sparkling World Series rings. A year ago, opening day welcomed a brand new palace, the new Yankee Stadium. This year, the home opener gave the Yankees one last chance to honor the legends of the fall. The Yanks received their World Series rings Tuesday afternoon in style. Bomber legends Whitey Ford and Yogi Berra, who know a thing or two about fall classics, having collected 16 World Series rings between the two of them, handed out the Balfour Beauties, with the boss himself, George Steinbrenner, looking on. You talk about the first stop you made today upstairs to see the boss and deliver that ring. How special for you for that entire moment? Yeah, like I said a little while ago, that's the thing I take the most from uh, this opening day was getting an opportunity to go up there and present him with his ring because none of us would be here, the stadium wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the ball. And in keeping true to every sense of the words tradition and unity, the Yankees welcomed home their World Series hero, who now calls Anaheim home. World Series MVP Hideki Matsui, who signed with the Angels in the offseason, was the last to get his ring, receiving the loudest standing ovation. And Matsui, obviously, you know, I mean, one of the great guys that we have here before being on. See him, you know, and, and be with him. Yes, a uh, tremendous player, uh, tremendous amount of respect for him. And so, it's, you know, he deserves it. Andy Pettit authored the perfect ending to a perfect afternoon by pitching a gem in a 7-5 opening day win over the Angels, the same club the Yankees defeated to reach the World Series last fall. Captain Derek Jeter homered, and closer Mariano Rivera did what he does best, putting the finishing touches on the victory with another save. Even the newest Yankees were awestruck by the day. Got a chance to see some of the rings when they came in and got a chance to look at uh, Phil Hughes' ring just afterwards in the food room. Um, but it's great you know, uh, to see what they've done and accomplished and how the fans of the city have embraced their accomplishment and how hungry they are for another one.